All right, set to go, and this is the final term. And of course, uh, a very big crowd here today, around about the six or seven thousand mark, and uh, it just goes to show that uh, if the standard's good enough, which the standard has been good in the statewide cup for most of the year, uh, people turn up to see these matches. And it's good to see them turn up to follow their reserves too, because I think the young fellows love a bit of backing, don't they? My word, they do. Any support, Lou? Gratefully accepted. Into the final term, who's going to take it out? Gibb in ruck for Essendon. Up against Doug Dale. An indecisive tap. No one able to take the ball away. Paul Christie tried to burst his way through and in fact has come out with the free kick. That looked like an illegal tackle, but the umpire has called play on. It's opened the gate for Peter Bennett of Essendon. Henderson comes out. Not paid the mark. This is extraordinary at the moment and it lets uh, Barbary through. A snap at goal in towards goal it goes and he's put through one point over. Yeah, I thought that was a mark to Henderson. I thought the tackle from the, when the young Christie had a free kick was from behind, uh, which is illegal. Ramsey back into play. The bouncing ball, eluding all. Demetrio could have been tackled high, but play on is called. Dugdale has an airy. Shinners, as Bobby said, tried his heart out in that third term. Now the opportunity for Barry Bosenko. Flicks a high ball. Doherty went up a mile too early. And Henderson takes it over the line throw in some 50 metres around from the Essendon goal. They lead by one straight kick. Tapped over the back. Brightus is there. Claims it. Needs support. Bennett pushing the ball forward once again. Opens it up for his teammate. Here's a shot in towards full forward. In fact, centering the ball. North Melbourne again to relieve the pressure. Coming from Hurd. Out towards the half-back line goes Byron, and a good mark too. North Melbourne playing on now, they only trailed by six points. Ramsey's come down to receive the handball, puts it up towards the centre wing area. Easton and Walsh are both there. Smith now for North Melbourne, caught. The ball being held, and that's what the umpire says. And we'll see a ball up take place. Two minutes into the last quarter, and six points the difference in favour of Essendon. Anybody's game as the ball is tapped out by Gibb, going after it is Muir. And it beats him and it's out of bounds. This time it's on North Melbourne's half four line, about 60 metres around from their goal. North Melbourne trailed by 19 points at one stage during the second quarter, but they've fought back uh, north and they're well in this game. As it comes out now to Christie, a good hand pass out to Wright, who's been an outstanding player for North. Up towards the full forward, but there's only a push in the back that time to Martin. The umpire spotted this one. It's Drake, I'm sorry. Drake. Martin's number 50. Drake with the mark, about, or uh, well, the free kick, about uh, 40 metres out from goal. You can see the goals there in the background. So what he can do with this one. Some level scores, he doesn't even make the distance. Walsh gets up high, nearly holds the mark. Coming out of the pack that time was Foreman. He hasn't played a bad game either. Punched away by Gibb. Back there to Doug Dowd, he got a touch of the fumbles. Pushed away again by Eustace. Oh, Doherty it was. And Demetrio gets a hand pass back towards centre half. Fires a push <laughs> in the back. Uh, by Gibb, right in the middle of... Uh, you could Duck say there Dale's was no back. doubt about that one. But I don't think he stays it either. You couldn't blame him for that, so he takes the free kick at uh, centre-half forward, uh, Doug Dale. Hasn't had the greatest of days, but he did uh, have a part in the last goal. They kicked just before three-quarter time. Chance now for Doug Dale to land this well in the goal square. The kick falls a bit short, and a good mark taken there by Foreman again. And as I said before, Bobby hasn't played a bad game, has he? Particularly since half-time, uh, Lou. He's uh, come into the game in that third quarter and uh, given Essendon quite a bit of drive. But some, one of his problems is a kick like that. Uh, they're just as far from goal now as they were when Foreman had the ball. Barry Bazanko's kick is up there towards uh, Merritt. It's tapped out to Hurd. He goes another hand pass over to Thompson. A long hand pass out there towards Dowdy. Fumbles the ball. It's a bad fumble, but Lux and Fortune bounces back for him. He balked his opponent. Now he goes for a kick, looking up there for uh, Donnell, and he's got him. And Donnell would be about uh, 35 metres out, and he's already kicked three goals. The Bombers are in front by uh, four points at the moment, six points. Let's see what he can do with the kick. And we're approaching the four and a half minute mark of the last quarter. Oh, is it not coming around enough? And it's through for a point. So the difference now is seven points. It's 11 goals, 15-81. Essendon to North Melbourne, 11 goals, 8-74. Ramsey back in.